Hi friends, it is Leslie in the Cozy Yellow Cottage. Welcome back. Today I'm giving you a short video and a small tour of the fall lived-in living room. <laughs> I always say it's lived-in because it's never clean. Never clean. I'm starting out here on the table. I always keep a basket to hold remotes and whatever. Then I have a flower arrangement up there and that ceramic pumpkin. And I love the pillows that are on the sofa this year. Those blue ones are so pretty. And here I have a pumpkin patch sign. You've seen that last year. And on the back of it, if you remember, is an ice skating um, picture that I painted. Here on the shelf, I have a little arrangement and that little squirrel with the pumpkin my daughter just got me at HomeSense. And of course, there's Jesus there to remind us when we're misbehaving. Over here, there is a huge pile of dog toys, you know, that the babies are always there. And then I did have to do some rearranging again. And I brought the little table on this side of the room so that I could add the church. And then, of course, my little favorite squirrel holding a coffee. I love that one. And my girlfriend gave me this squirrel picture from... Um, I believe that's an old home interior picture. And then this photo I just framed, that was me and my girls last year apple picking. So the dogs were a little crazy because um, my pizza was delivered and they were going berserk. <laughs> I had to mute it and that is why I'm doing this voiceover today. So up here, I kept it pretty simple. I just added this garland and lights with our family photos there are a few pumpkins up there, and that's all. I feel like I am being very simple this year, believe it or not. I do have to wash all those little glass panels. I haven't done that yet. Ugh. Here, I put that little round table in between the recliners and just added the country ham lamp. I love that lamp. And then behind it, I have a little trunk with the crate of books. Children's books are my absolute favorite. They, the illustrations in some of those books are gorgeous. So over here, I took down Paul's work picture and added the wagon of pumpkins. And then you can see I have the pie cabinet over there with a few things on it. That is it. Like, I don't know what else. I, I think... I think I'm just so used to this room and you guys have seen the ledges so I'm not going to explain those but you do see the aliens are back up there in their spot. <laughs> so in the next video I will take you into the dining room I believe. Of course the ugly air conditioner is in the window. Um, as ugly as it is I couldn't do without it this summer. Oh my goodness it was crazy. So Stanley and Charlotte get so excited when food is delivered as they think it's for them. And honestly, they do get a little french fry or a piece of crust or something. So yeah, they're no dummies. <laughs> Here is one last look of the living room before it gets messy again. <laughs> the dogs are outside. Give them about an hour and there will be dog toys all over this floor. I'm not kidding. <laughs> Stanny, did you get a new baby? Let me see it. What you got? Oh my goodness. Did you get a new baby? What you got? Did you get a new baby? Charlotte got a new baby, too. What did you get? Let me see. What you got? It looks like you. What you got? Who is this? Give me this. Give me that. <laughs> You're rough with your toys. Sandy's not. I wanted to show you that um, I'm surprised that she didn't grab the blanket herself because anytime I put a fresh blanket out, Charlotte will steal it. She loves blankets 
and here you can see why she is my little blanket sucker. She will lay there forever and just suck on blankets and watch TV. <laughs> These dogs are too much. So, guys, thank you so much for joining me in this random small little living room tour. Um, if you have any questions, please just ask in the comment box. I appreciate you and thank you for joining me.